all of you who've joined us um, after the annual general meeting of the society, which we've I've managed to do without falling over and without breaking the computer and without doing anything too wrong, which is amazing. So uh, welcome back to all of you in the room, but also all of you joining online for this, which is this, which is our anniversary meeting at which we celebrate our medalist. So every year, the Linnaean Society awards a series of medals and prizes for excellence in the field of natural history. Some of these medals have been on the go since the late 19th century, and others are much more recent. Um, every year over my presidency of the last four years, I've chaired the nominations and awards committee, and I've really been humbled by the excellence of our medalists. The people to whom we'll be award medals today really represent the best in the science of natural history, and it's wonderful to be able to meet them both in person and also online today. <laughs> um, these, all these people are re truly making significant contributions to the furtherance of the society's vision of a world where nature is understood, valued, and protected. So what will happen now is a council member will introduce each medalist and then the awardee, then the awardee will have a, a, a moment to speak um, after I hand them over their medal. So we're bound to make mistakes. Something is bound to go wrong, but hopefully I won't fall over. You know, which will be good. That would be a good thing. So, um, so here we go. The Linnaean Medal for Zoology is awarded to Mr. Rohan Pethiagoda, who will be introduced by Council Member Elaine Shaughnessy. Elaine, would you like to come up? Elaine has her, has her, Elaine has her leg in a cast, by the way, for those of you online. <laughs> so it makes it more dramatic. <laughs> Um, it's a tremendous pleasure and a great personal pleasure to read the citation for Mr. Rohan Pethiagoda. Rohan has been an employee of and advisor to the government of Sri Lanka, serving as chairman of the water board in the 1980s. His 1991 monumental freshwater fishes of Sri Lanka was hailed as a landmark achievement, treating the island's diverse ichthyofauna more comprehensively and authoritatively than ever before. Over the next decade, both Rohan and his Wildlife Heritage Trust, set up with profits from the book, became synonymous with the exploration, discovery and documentation of Sri Lanka's biodiversity and the wider application of this to enhance biogeography of the broader region. His programme of original and collaborative research, both Sri Lankan and overseas, has resulted in publications on many zoological groups in addition to fishes. His impact on biodiversity research in Sri Lanka and beyond through his output and catalytic influence cannot be overestimated. Congratulations. Many, many to the council and to Sandy for this fantastic honor. I had no idea I had been nominated or um, until I heard from Sandy in an email that um, I had been awarded the medal. I, I was um, deeply touched and hugely shocked and surprised. And it so happened that I had work in Europe next week. And so I was able to be here in person. I'm so uh, happy about that because I've known uh, the Lynn Sock from 1990s when I used to come and research in the library with uh, Gina Douglas, who is now retired, but I'm told that she might be here today. Hi, Gina. Uh, um, so this, this society has been very close to my heart. Um, as Elaine said, I've worked in Sri Lanka for most of my life. I divide my time now between Sri Lanka and Australia and the Australian Museum. And as you might have seen in the news, Sri Lanka has fallen on hard times. But um, at the time of the society's founding in the early uh, 19th century, there was a huge uh, series of inter uh, interactions between the society and uh, scientists and then Ceylon. As a result of this, the, the library contains some unique uh, archival material from that period. Um, and a huge chunk of the botanical and zoological exploration of Ceylon and its history are reposed in this building, including one possible uh, butterfly type of Linnaeus. So this is something um, very close to my heart. It 
gives me huge pleasure again to thank all of you in the Society and the Council for this honor. Thank you very much. <clears throat> The Linnaean Medal.